every exhaustion perk ranked from worst to best in Dead by Daylight. The worst exhaustion perk is going to smash hit. Unfortunately, if a killer sees that you have this, they're just going to start respecting pallets and trying not to get stunned as much as possible. And there's a ton of killers in the game that kind of just ignore pallets like Huntress or Nurse or even the Knight. The next spot is going to head on. Good killers will start to bait lockers if they know that you have head on. And unfortunately with head on, you kind of need to make an entire build around it. The next spot is going to balance landing. It's just not viable on a lot of maps, which makes it kind of underwhelming. The next spot is going to overcome. I actually think overcome is really underrated. This is just really helpful because holding W is one of the strongest things to do in this game, especially against slow killers with no mobility and can especially help you get out of a dead zone if you're in an area with no safety. The third spot is going to life. It just allows you to get from one area to another area very effectively. The second spot, dead hard. I do not think that dead hard is the best exhaustion perk in the game. There's a lot of very easy counterplay to it unless you're like going to a pallet, for example. And the number one spot, of course, is going to sprint burst. So yeah, that is 